We're going to start off with Mike Singer. Hey, Nicola, good to see you. Um, for you, obviously, a, a ton of really good things. The defense, the, the, the bench stepped up. Uh, Jamal played really well. You had a triple-double. What, what was the best part of tonight's win for you? Uh, probably togetherness. Probably we all were locked in and probably we were all um, uh, knowing uh, we, we, all, we all know how we can win the game, you know. Uh, we didn't turn the ball over. That, that was a big... Big, big deal. I think we rebound really good in the second half. Ryan Blackburn. Hey, Nicola. I don't know if Zeke Naji really expected to play 24 minutes tonight, given uh, Paul going down, but it, it seemed like he came in and really gave you guys some good minutes, good, smart basketball again, going against LeBron. What did you see from him out there? And what do you, what do you like about his game tonight? I mean, he's shooting the ball right now really well. You know, that, that, that's something that we, we need. Um, and uh, he was really good uh, defensively, you know. He, he's still learning, he's still a rookie, uh, but we, I think we can help him a lot uh, when, we play, when we play together. Harrison Wind. To follow up on that, Malone just called Zeke a really smart basketball player. Does it seem like he's picking up a lot of the little tips and, and, and tricks you're, you're yeah. holding it on during a game? Uh, yeah, I mean, he he's a really good listener, you know, and he's really willing to listen. He's trying to do. I mean, I think I can help him a little bit. And the coach, probably nobody wants to tell someone, a young guy, to do something stupid, you know. So we all trying to help uh, the young guys, and he's really smart, you know. He's working really hard, and um, and then it's it's paying off. Go to Matt Moore. Nicola Blacko got on the board tonight and hit that three. And I want to know uh, why, how you felt and why you're so excited for him in that moment. Because he's working hard. You know, he's same as Zeke. Uh, he's working hard and uh, I think he deserved a chance. And I think he, he's, he's using this, like say stupid time, like with injuries, with, with everything, you know, he's using it really well, you know. Uh, he's he's fighting through uh, through the injuries that he had, you know. So he, he knows that this is his chance, and he's he's gonna do whatever he needs to do to to, to get some minutes, you know. And I'm I'm really happy to, for the guys who are working hard for something and they really uh, want to win and want to play with, with a good team in basketball. Joel Rush. Hey, Nicola. Uh, Coach has talked some about you guys being a different team from the team that went to the Western Conference Finals last season and it not being really fair to have the same expectations of you being the same team this season. But how close do you feel you are to competing at that same level as you did in the playoffs last season with the group you have now? Uh, it's hard, you know. We have a lot of guys who didn't play. Uh, so it, um, it's really hard, you know. But we, we don't want to give up. Like, even even the last year, nobody trust kind of in us, nobody believe in us. But we we kind of I think surprise everybody. So maybe we can do it this year, you know. So but it's really hard just because losing some really good, really big uh, uh, factors in our team, you know, and uh, replace it with the young guys who never never played the game, never played, never been to playoffs. Um, I think it, that, that I mean we're gonna miss experience. In, the most probably. We'll go back to Mike Singer. Nicola, uh, 10 days ago, you only had 13 points uh, against the Lakers. Obviously, have a triple double tonight. What, what was the difference? I think just my mindset. Uh, they, they surprised me. I, I started to even on the, I don't know who. Uh, they, 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 really, they really did a good, good job, you know. They're a really long athletic team. They, they cover a lot of foot, kind of surface you know I, you cannot go anywhere they're always in a gap they they were just uh, they, they, surpri they surprised me and uh, I just uh, and I will say it's really hard to play against them because it, I would like I mean they have Anthony Davis who is a defensive player of the year they had they have Marcus Sol who is defensive player you know it's really it's really hard but the just I think my mindset was a little bit different just to don't let that affect me and just um, mm. If I'm open to it, if if 
if I see someone is calm, just pass the ball, just don't overthink, uh, overthink uh, anything. Alexander Zikic. Nikola Fantastična pobjeda, čestitam također još jedan triple double i kako bi opisao utakmicu što je bilo drugačije, da li si uspio malo da nađeš i više rješenje za Anthony Davisa i Marga Sova ovoga puta, odnosno na susreda od prednje koliko dana? Da, ba eto, sad baš da kažem, drugačije, jako su dugački, jako pokrivaju punu površinu, samo kada stoje raše ruke nema mnogo mesta gde da se ide i nema mnogo mesta za pasove, tako da... Mislim, zato su osvojali prošle godine prvenstvo, kako se već kaže, ali eto, nisam puno razmišljao, nisam teo da to utiče na mene, tako da to je bio neki moj psihološki ulazak u utakmicu, samo ako sam otvoren da šutnem, ako vidim neku dvajnju ili bilo što da pustim pas, tako da nisam puno razmišljao nešto moram, nešto ne moram, samo sam igrao jednostavno. Hvala, Nikola. Hvala, Nikola.